students next we will try to understand the difference between weight and mass now what is mass mass is a total content it is a total content of the object now mass is a scalar quantity okay mass is a scalar quantity it is a total content of the object the unit is kg okay si unit is kg and mass can never be zero can never be zero even if you are there on the moon or any other planet the mass is same mass will not change now what is weight weight is nothing but it's a force of attraction force of attraction that is felt by the object because of the gravitational force it is a force of attraction that is felt by the object by the object because of the gravitational force force so force of attraction that is experienced or felt by the object because of the gravitational force now the weight is nothing but it's a vector quantity okay it is a vector quantity and the si unit of weight okay si unit of weight is newton and weight can be zero it can be zero now actually weight is given by the formula w is equal to mg now suppose if g is zero if acceleration due to gravity is zero then mass will automatically be zero that's why i'm telling w is w can be zero or the weight can be zero it is found that right at the center of the earth the acceleration due to gravity becomes zero so weight can can be zero in this particular case students the acceleration due to gravity varies at the poles as well as the equator now we know the distance is comparatively more at the equator than at the poles so when the distance is more the acceleration due to gravity is less if the distance is less the acceleration due to gravity is more okay we know that force is inversely proportional to the distance square so more the distance less will be the force of attraction more the distance less will be the acceleration due to gravity okay less the distance more will be the acceleration due to gravity remember this